Welcome back to Life is Strange. We're about to hang out with Chloe at the junkyard. Is this a race? Keep up. How many times are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you, and how well you do in this phase of the test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super-sized? We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. Are you kidding? After yesterday, I'm kind of over guns, Chloe. <sighs> Freaks me out that you have one. Don't you trust me? Yes, but not that gun. You have more power than an army. Don't be scared of my little toy. Besides, we need it for the test. Drink? Yuck. <laughs> you are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer and guns? <sighs> nice combo. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles. Pretty please. Okay, there's gotta be at least one, maybe multiple photo opportunities here. I see probably Chloe with the gun. Looks like the... Is that the lighthouse in the background of the image, though? And then something with 142 on it that could perhaps be a train number. And then also a doe by a tree that could be here. So possibly up to three picture opportunities here, I think. Looks just like I remember it. Whoops. Oh, wait a second. Oh, hey, wait, this is 142. I think that's what I need to take a picture of. Uh, but also, I think this might be the, the quote-unquote lighthouse in the image. Maybe? Kind of looks like it. I don't know. Stupid bottle. Hello, bottle number one. Four more to go. No, oh, you actually can You actually can see the lighthouse in the background there. Very small and faint though. Is there smoke over there or is that just a lot of dust? Looks like smoke. So sad to look at a grounded boat. I wonder who owned that and where they are now. It's hard to believe that was once on the road, filled with dozens of students. Beyond repair. Rest in peace. This is the scariest thing here. Looks like it could be one of Rachel's shirts. Oh, I wonder if the, um, the old car. Chloe's old family car that she and William were in with it. Or actually, no, sorry, Chloe wasn't in it. I, for some reason, I picture Chloe being in the car with William when it crashed, but I think that's just because before the storm, 
She keeps having that recurring dream of her being in the car while that happens, but she actually wasn't. Oh, poor thing. They left you here all alone. So disturbing to see old syringes on the ground. What does that say? Something... What, perchance, stream? All this rusted metal makes me feel serene. Am I morbid or just goth? Hmm. Huh. I could use this board as a bridge. Doesn't look too heavy. Those shells look fresh. The Bigfoots were here. <laughs> Very sad looking deflated football. Just looks like a chunk of meat. Way heavier than I thought. Ugh. Boom. Only three bottles left. Although this junkyard is a dive, I see why Chloe hangs here. She's a steampunk. It actually feels like Chloe and I are kids again. We're hiding out and plotting our future. Despite all the chaos and bullshit, I feel so giddy hanging out with her again. So happy. Like we've both gone back in time. Warren. No worries about not going ape with me. Thought it would be cool to take a road trip in the new wheels. I'll just drive in circles around town. I'm sorry, Warren. Hard week. I still owe ya. Yes, you do. Let me know if you change your mind. Winky face. <laughs> This looks like a graffiti museum for Chloe and Rachel. I bet I can find out more about Rachel here. It's gonna be written on the wall, isn't it? Just like we saw in Before the Storm. First to the top, Chloe was here, and then right below that, Rachel was here. Yep. Now we're officially a trio. We just have to find Rachel. <sighs> I don't want to intrude, but I was here. So Rachel did go to a Vortex Club party. This flyer is dated right before she disappeared. I want to die. <sighs> Jeez. Who wrote this? Three down, two more to go. Talk about finding a bottle in a haystack. Ouch. This might be a picture opportunity to... let's go back.
Yeah, no joke. Look at the train number. This isn't a picture opportunity, actually, but look at that. 1337. I remember at the very beginning, the first episode of Before the Storm, I think it began with Chloe kind of on the train track, and then right before the train was about to hit her, she kind of jumped off and went over to the, the mill. And the train said 1337. It honestly said Leet. And I thought, what in the hell? But I guess they're just... I guess they're just following the Life is Strange lore. This train originally said 1337. God, it's disturbing to get so close. Watching it go by so fast. Juliet and Zachary love forever. Don't think we're done in here yet, though. I remember putting this up in Before the Storm. They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. I remember seeing those being taken at the end of Before the Storm. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. That kind of hurts. Mm hmm. They would have gone all the way to Los Angeles for a rave. Looks fun. <laughs> is, that, is that supposed to be Chloe and Rachel? My god, those drawings are terrible. Ooh, looks like Rachel was definitely winning at darts. I guess they found some darts. I remember putting up the board, but not finding any darts. Thanks for the tip. spot where people party around here. Is it just... Oh, I see it. Is it just from me walking in here? Hmm. And now I'm trapped and I will die here unless I use my powers. I'm sure this is a popular party pit. One more bottle to go. Whoops. Uh, I think I rewound too much. Yep, I just unwrote my name. Uh, one second. There we go. Also just got a text message from Kate. Uh, Max, I want to thank you for giving me such great advice about going to the police and telling them everything about Nathan. I so appreciate you standing by me. Keeps my faith. Kate, I'm on your side. Please don't mention me too much if you can. I'm already in trouble around here. And thanks so much for talking to me this morning. I was about to have a serious cry and I need a friend. You were there. As usual. Ah, there's all the bottles. Voila. Now I can deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. I wonder if Chloe thinks about her father when she looks at all these smashed up cars. I have a vague memory of a doe being somewhere around here. Wow, sir. <gasps> there it is. That looks exactly like the same doe from my tornado vision. 
That doe is the perfect photo op. It doesn't show up in the photograph, right? If I remember right? Yeah. Doesn't show up in the photograph. What? My rewind power doesn't work on her? I don't get it. A doe out of place, out of time. Okay, so I think this bus is a photo opportunity as well. This was an old school punk shirt. Where do I take a photograph of it, though? Hmm. It showed 142 in the photographs. This is definitely it. I tried to photograph her from the other side and couldn't. It does show it, doesn't it? Yeah. 142. Huh. Ah, oh, there we go. You can actually photograph it from the other side. The original side that I saw it from. You just gotta be in just the right place. So right now it just says, look, but if you're right here, photograph. Look at that strange little 2D bird right on the very top of the school bus. Thanks, Max. One more for the road. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Whoops, 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 no, 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 no. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. <laughs> oh, yes! Did you see that shit, Max? Duh. That was so fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. Slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here. Give me something to shoot, Max. I have a vague memory of Chloe shooting something and like, I don't know, the bullet ricocheting off and hitting her or something. Mm. Hello, what should I shoot? Well, that a high chance of ricochet over there. Hello, what should I shoot? How about that? I bet you want to blow apart those old computer monitors. Let's reboot them with a bullet. <laughs> old school. Lame. Lame? That was awesome, but Chloe wants those bottles down. 
What, you want to ricochet off something that's gonna then hit the bottle? Give me something to shoot, Max. Let's see you take a crack at that rusty barrel. Sorry, Mr. Barrel, your time has come. Listen to those fat bullet beats! God, that's so dangerous. Give me some- Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now? Hella yes! Nice shooting, Tex. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like, never? So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Put a real dent in that front bumper. Goodbye, cruel bumper. <laughs> Jesus, I sh shot myself! Ugh, I shot myself! Back up, back Stupid up! gun? Hold on, Chloe. Yeah, I thought so. Dude, I need a target before- How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. Uber cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. I'm glad I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. This has got to be where I get the picture though, right? Yeah, there we go. Should be all of them from here? Yeah, I think so. Okay, looks like you're ready to lock and load. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this, and I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now, That's and I- That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret it, girl. I mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? 
Please. Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Remember Chloe used to be Frank's favorite client? Yeah, I mean, he wasn't exactly a teddy bear in Before the Storm, although Chloe kind of thought of him as that. But he's definitely not the same now. I think I'm going to shoot. That is hilarious. Oh, man. I'll remember you, kid. I'll remember you almost shot me. And you'll wish I had no memory, because I never forget. You have until Friday to pay me. Don't ever pull crap like this again. It'll be the last time you do. Try bullets next time, brainiacs. Sorry. You are awesome. Thanks for standing up for me. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Jesus, I almost shot this guy. And now he'll be more dangerous to Chloe and me. You just assumed it was going to try to be a warning shot, but I guess it wasn't. Um, hmm. Let's go back and try the other option. Come on, girly. Shoot me. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. That's right. Doesn't he end up taking the gun? Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Ah. I'm going to go back to the other option. I want to keep it this time. Okay, wow, so keeping the gun this time. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk up. Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. We both need a time out from here. I still can't believe you pulled a gun on Frank. That was epic. It felt awful. I'm glad there was no bullets in there. You can just rewind time in your hand and stick that barrel right up Frank's ass. You have the power! You're gross. Don't fall. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Doesn't Chloe's boot end up getting stuck in the track here? Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? I'm still freaked out about what happened. That was awful, Chloe. I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, did you see what just happened? I almost shot him. I know I could rewind, but Chloe, this is not playtime. No more guns. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has 
a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Perfect. Ugh. thingy up here we gotta do something with a uh, crowbar or something I can definitely use this bad boy I just forgot exactly for what Come on, Max. shit I can't budget at all uh, score Let's see if I can do this without having to rewind uh, what am I looking for I can pull a total MacGyver. Is this, is this enough? Uh, I don't yeah, know what I'm doing this for. Something is blocking the drum. Oh, little uh, wood stopper thing. Gotta push it out. Probably with the crowbar. The train's coming. Max, now I can finally move the drum. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, I didn't quite do it. Damn, that was close. You saved me again. Crazy. We were totally bombed in life. You okay? I got splinters in my ass and leg, so I wish there was a less violent way for you to save me. And now the trains can't get to the lumber mill. Oops. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. Can you imagine just going to class after all of that? Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh, it means shit happens, right? No, crazy shit happens. Because it can. And will. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again.
have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Okay. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.